information tonight about the speaker slated to talk at a county attorney staff training. Maricopa County Attorney Bill Montgomery is sponsoring the event for hundreds of prosecutors and law enforcement officers. Speaker Joe Guandalo believes the CIA director is a closeted Muslim, and now he's smearing Muslim leaders in the valley. Bram Resnick has the story from North Phoenix. Bram? Tram, that Islam expert was so ticked that Muslim leaders here were opposing his visit. He smeared three of them as, quote, known Muslim Brotherhood members, including the president of this mosque. But Bill Montgomery is standing by his man. Usama Shami has grown accustomed to labels. My son is on uh, no fly list. He's 11 years old. Now Shami, a leader of this North Phoenix mosque, has been labeled himself as a Muslim Brotherhood member. It's in this new blog post by a self-described expert on the global Islamic threat. And you can Google my name. I don't think it's going to come up on any Muslim Brotherhood list. The blogger, Joe Guandolo, also believes CIA Director John Brennan switched sides. He converted to Islam while serving as the senior U.S. intelligence representative for the United States. Guandolo's coming to Phoenix next week to headline an event called Understanding the Threat of Hamas, Hezbollah, and Sharia Law. That's the point, associating the faith with terrorism, associating, uh, associating community members, with terrorism. Maricopa County Attorney Bill Montgomery is sponsoring the event for law enforcement and prosecutors. He seems to be buying that Brennan conversion story. That hasn't been denied by the speaker. The Republican prosecutor defends the event, featuring another speaker, Claire Lopez, who claims when Muslims follow their doctrine, they become jihadists. It's apparent to me at this point that uh, the training is being mischaracterized as it was at other locations. Shami and several Muslim leaders have pleaded with Montgomery to cancel it. But he's not changing anything. And now Shami fears the labels will spread. Once the damage is done, you cannot erase that. A Montgomery spokesman tells me uh, this county attorney asked Guandolo, Guandolo to take down that blog post today because, quote, it does not reflect our community, but Guandolo is still expected to appear next week. Live in North Phoenix, Bram Resnick, 12 News.